Hey guys, what's up? We're here playing Monster Hunter World and if you guys haven't known yet, there's a new crossover event right now that's happening. It's called A Rush of Blood. In this event, you can actually get tickets to get a Mega Man armor for your Polico cat. Isn't that cool? Dressing up your cat companion as Mega Man. So this quest is pretty simple. Basically, you're gonna be pit against these two order Gorons. There's one small one and one big one. And after you finish the quest, you're gonna get at least one or two Mega Man tickets and you need a total of five to get the full armor. So you're gonna probably have to do this quest a few times to get all the tickets. It's a standard 7 star mission, so it's gonna be pretty hard. Pretty hard. Well, it depends, if you're pro like me, it's gonna be pretty easy. Uh, my character looks really badass right now, yeah. Just look at that guy. Look at that guy. He's not even that to me. I like, I like to go from behind. Also, like they have a blind spot behind. They're fast, they're fast, but they can't turn fast. That's why I like to stop, heal up, because you know, your life is important. Yeah, that's my police cat right there, taking some of the damage. And right now, I'm gonna ride him like a cowboy. Crap. Okay, rope him back in. Coming back on you. Let's go. Where are you taking me? You're not taking me anywhere. I'm just gonna stab you in the back. Gravity stab, stab, stab. Pretty simple fight. If you're cool like me, pretty simple fight. Stun him, get him from the back. That's the that's that's the way you beat this guy. You gotta get him from the back. Cause they have a blind spot. Or oh, you know, sacrifice your cat right there. He's gonna take more damage. Oh crap, okay, never mind, give him that hit. Just gotta wait for him to turn his back and I get my chance to hit! Like I said, you're gonna probably have to do this fight a bunch of times because you only get one or two Mega Man tickets and you need at least five. No, you need five exactly to get the helmet, the suit, and the weapon. And up there, almost beating this guy. You know what, what I like about this event is since it's a Mega Man crossover, like during this fight they actually play like retro old music, like the kind of music you hear in a Mega Man game. Uh, that's right, blind spot. Oh, oh, crap, he's angry now. Oh, oh! Hey, I think you're missing a tail. That's right. Now he's angry. Now he's angry. Got him all riled up. Like I said, you have a 15 minute time limit on this mission and you can only die three times. But that's more enough. Like you don't, I, I, I didn't even die once. Gotta sharpen my blade because it's getting real dull. Gotta maximize that damage, you know. Can't fight a monster with a dull blade. Oh, got you down. Stab. Oh, yeah! Got his tail off. What else am I gonna cut off? Hey, that's a cheap shot right now. And your back is turned. He has not learned his lesson. That's a pretty cool crossover, you know. Never have I known that you would actually be able to dress your Polico cat as Mega Man. 
Like I heard actually, uh, the next the next crossover event is gonna be BMC Devil May Cry. So, what am I gonna look like uh, Nero, or is my cat gonna look like Nero? I don't know. But I like these kind of games, you know. Like they keep you interested. It's not like just a base game. You buy what you buy is what you get. They actually add in more stuff every time. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Did this guy die? Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. Yeah, last roar. Is that your last words? Is that your last word right there? Alright, time to harvest the goods. Cutting you up, getting that ore to make them armor. Make special armor. I want that ore to get on armor right there. Alright, get some scales, some tails, scales, tails. I think that's pretty much done. Do I have anything else to collect? Just like that. This guy went down. Without a sweat. Quest is complete. I am complete. I'm gonna be complete with this armor. As you can see, those are the rewards I got, all the things I scavenged. And that's a Mega Man, that right there. It's a Mega Man, Mega Man ticket. I got a Mega Man ticket right there. I got two this time, but I got enough. Alright, here we are, let's go to that smithy. Tell me in the comment below if you think my character is cool, because I think he's cool. Alright, there you are, the smithy. Want something making? Nothing's up, I just want my Mega Man armor. Right there, Mega Man armor. <laughs> it looks so cute. It's like an 8-bit armor in a realistic kind of looking game. Alright, you now you need a weapon. Mm, let's get your Mega Buster. Alright, cutscene! Yay, Mega Buster! Gotta put some wood in there, smash some metal. No, that's a scale. And there you go! Equip it now. Whew, pretty cool, pretty cool. My Polico cats are looking really cool right now. There you go. Little Stefano, aka Mega Man. Pretty matching, right? We look, we look, we look like a great team. <laughs> he looks so cool. He's kind of cute too. Alright, so as you can see, it's pretty simple to get it. Just got to do that quest a few times. And let's end the day with some food. Yeah, thank you for some food. Alright, so guys, this, this quest is actually a rank 13 quest and you can only do it until the April 27th. So after the April 27th, it's not there anymore. So don't waste time, go get this armor, show it off to your friends and keep on mega blasting. Alright, so guys, thanks for watching this video and do let us know below if you actually got the armor and maybe we can play together, who knows. Alright, so thanks for watching guys, hope you guys get the armor and do remember to subscribe to our channel and also follow us on Instagram. See you guys!